good afternoon yeah introduce yourself yeah it's my pleasure to introduce myself i am joseph i am from karnal my family consists of five members my father is contractor and my mother is homemaker i have two brothers and my i have completed my graduation with the specialization of electrical electronic engineering in kvs rit in karnal during my graduation i have done my project that is investigation on stability of microgrids and logical thinking and creative thinking and i am good at all mainframe modules like uh, uh, jcl vzam cobol and db2 and I, i like to play cricket and watching uh, watching movies those are my hobbies and i want to become a mainframe developer with in repeated repeated organizations that is my Can you rate yourself in the mainframe modules like JSL, Cobol, VZM, Dimitri, out of five? Sorry. Can you rate yourself out of five? Rate. Rate yourself. Yeah, ma'am. Uh, I want to give five rating. With all modules. All modules. Okay. Yes. Okay. Can we start start with Cobol? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Mm. Explain redefence. Redefence. So by uh, redefence, which is one of the memory redu- reducing techniques. So reducing uh, redefence is nothing but we can reuse the already existing of memory. Okay. Yes. Which level number we can use and which type of where uh, where play elementary variables or sub elementary? What are the uses for? Yeah, redefence we can declare in zero uh, one level numbers and also seventy seven level numbers. And also subgroup level, also we can't declare in special level numbers. Okay. What is the difference between zero one to forty nine level number and uh, other special level numbers? Zero one to forty nine numbers. Okay. So zero one level zero one level number is which is elementary level numbers, mm-hmm. and sometimes it will act as group level numbers. Mm-hmm. And zero to forty nine is a sub mm-hmm. subgroup level numbers. Mm-hmm. So without main group elements, we can't declare the subgroup level numbers. Mm-hmm. And uh, coming to special level numbers. or there is no picture clause so that is the main differences between level numbers okay how many types of level numbers are there yeah there are five level uh, there are five types of level numbers first one is zero one level numbers uh, which is uh, group level level numbers and also uh, second one is subgroup level numbers uh, from 0 to 49 and 77 is a pure independent uh, independent level numbers and 66 which is uh, it is a renames level number and 88 is a conditional level number. and there is no picture class which uh, those are uh, special level numbers okay, in what case uh, 88 level number we can use in which case yeah ma'am uh, in uh, conditional uh, first of all 88 level number is a special level number mm-hmm. and we can call as uh, conditional names also so whenever the we have to check uh, uh, condition mm-hmm. the in that in that time we can use 88 level numbers in that uh, we have use uh, if and uh, evaluate conditions also Can you explain about evaluate statement? Yeah. So evaluate statement is nothing but it is a conditional statement. Uh, once the uh, once the evaluate statement is true, then only the con- uh, the control will enter into the uh, loop looping statement. One uh, one evaluate statement under um, in single evaluate statement we can write two fifty two fifty five when statements also. So in evaluate statement we can't uh, use uh, uh, logical and uh, uh, logical and relational operators. In uh, instead of those we can use uh, also operator. And also instead of uh, the main advantage is instead of number of if else statements we can use one evaluate statement. Okay. What is difference between continue and next sentence? Yeah, continue statement is nothing but do do nothing. So which is nothing but whenever the we can give after. Uh, uh, we can give the continue statement after the continue statement we can give the statements which is not working uh, con- uh, next sentence is nothing but after the next sentence we can give the statements or logics the control directly goes to the after dot of explain explain compilation process in cobol yeah in cobol compilation process will take three steps one is development uh, develop the program another one is compilation and execution So once we can develop the program, or we can write the program in Cobol sheet. After the uh, developing the pro- program, then we can compile that program. In compilation, having two steps. So by using compilation to check the errors, and also um, in in that we are using two utilities. 
so the utilities are IZY, CR, CTL, and IEWR, RHEWL. So when that that program input of the IZY, CR, CTL, that will gives the object code. So that object will that object code as take input of uh, link edits that uh, in that link edit uh, having IEWL. Uh, IE so um, that I link edit will give the load models and that load models as an input of execution in that execution we can give the two inputs one is load module another one is the program maps okay difference between subscript and index yeah. so subscript and index those are used in uh, occurs or, uh, and uh, arrays concepts so by using subscript to define the position particular element in the table and uh, sub, uh, index is nothing but it is also used to or to define the dispo number of disposition of particular element in the uh, array and also uh, index is represents the both position and uh, memory okay. for the elements where you can declare the index value index values so index values we can declare in uh, after uh, working storage section so after uh, after the declaring occurrences then only we can declare the index variable that index variable we can't declare in working story section okay. yeah life cycle of array how to declare an array array i don't know occur class what is the purpose of using occur class yeah by using occurs class we can define the position of the uh, particular element in the given table so by using occurs class uh, we can differentiate the normal variables and occurs variables in under in in working story section and also by using position we can declare or we can differentiate the normal variables and occurs variables in the processor division okay.